Bang Guru. Hello wrestling fans and welcome back to another video. This time we are comparing the WWF Hasbro and Broadcast Wrestling Ring sound effects modules. Obviously it was the WWF Hasbro that was the original and the Broadcast Wrestling Ring I believe is a Mexican bootleg. The Hasbro version has been with me from year dot. I picked that one up back in 1991 came with a wrestling ring and inside there was a Rowdy Roddy Piper Hasbro wrestling figure. The broadcast wrestling ring piece, well that is a recent pickup from eBay. I am aware, or I was aware, that they were out there and available, but track them on down, it proved quite hard. So with the video I'm going to show you how things work, the differences, if there is any, and I'd like to see if you enjoy the video too. If you've got any thoughts, questions or comments on the piece, let me know and I'll try and answer them for you too. So before we crack on with the video, don't forget to hit the like, share and subscribe button and check out our fantastic giveaway competition which is in our video catalogue. Here we go, here's the video. Right, let's show you a video of how they both sound and work. I will start off with the WWF Hasbro version. And this is what we have. Break it up. There's your Hasbro version now for the bootleg broadcast wrestling ring version. There we have it, there's your differences, there's not much is there. Both excellent pieces and thankfully now sitting nicely in the collection. What's your favourite piece out there in the Hasbro world? I wouldn't say the sound module is but it's something different and it was definitely a European exclusive. Now I have the bootleg, that's something else for the collection. Next week I've got a video, well coming Sunday, of a sticker album from Germany and I think you're all going to love it. Stay tuned. Get involved with the competition, and I'll see you all again soon. Oh, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We'll really appreciate that. Goodbye for now. <laughs>